Abide in Jesus, and ye shall receive power. This is your daily devotional reading. Give you to the Spirit, on July 6th, faith that works. And what shall I more say? For the time would fail me to tell of Gideon, and of Barak, and of Samson, and of Jephthah, of David also, and Samuel, and of the prophets, who through faith subdued kingdoms, wrought righteousness, obtained promises, stopped the mouth of lions, quenched the violence of fire, escaped the edge of the sword, out of weakness were made strong, waxed valiant in fight, turned to flight the armies of the aliens. Hebrews 11 verses 32-34 Faith is trust in God, believing that He loves us and knows best what is for our good. Thus, instead of our own, it leads us to choose His way. In place of our ignorance, it accepts His wisdom. In place of our weakness, His strength. In place of our sinfulness, His righteousness. Our lives, ourselves, are already His. Faith acknowledges His ownership and accepts its blessing. Truth, uprightness, purity have been pointed out as secrets of life's success. It is faith that puts us in possession of these principles. Every good impulse or aspiration is the gift of God. Faith receives from God the life that alone can produce true growth and efficiency. How to exercise faith should be made very plain. To every promise of God, there are conditions. If we are willing to do His will, all His strength is ours. Whatever gift He promises is in the promise itself. The seed is the Word of God. Luke 8 verse 11 As surely as the oak is in the acorn, so surely is the gift of God in His promise. If we receive the promise, we have the gift. Faith that enables us to receive God's gift is itself a gift of which some measure is imparted to every human being. It grows as exercised in appropriating the Word of God. In order to strengthen faith, we must often bring it in contact with the Word. In the study of the Bible, the student should be led to see the power of God's Word. In the creation, He spake, and it was done. He commended, and it stood fast. He calleth those things which be not as though they were, Psalm 33 verse 9, and Romans 4 verse 17, for when He calls them, they are. Gifted to the Spirit, July 6th.